three days. Three days. You're gonna like me. You're gonna like me three days, inshallah. Hey, I have a question for Ivan. Please, I have a question. Yes, I have a question. What about what about your your language? What about your language? What about Irish language? Where is your language right now? What's wrong with your language? You guys change? Hey, you guys change? You guys change? What about your language? Please, someone can give me an answer. What about the island language? You guys with England right now? You guys right now with England? You guys change your language? Give me answer, someone, if you can. It's very interesting. Hey, this guy, this guy talk about, this guy was English Empire, but his grandfather, Christopher McGregor, he worked with English Navy, and he killed your people. Now you guys support him. I'm gonna change this Saturday night. I know you guys gonna like me. My brothers, thank you so much for support me, inshallah. Inshallah, I will die, but I'm gonna go and beat this guy, inshallah. Thank you so much.
Vibing the room feels good, so vibing up. A lot of love from this crowd here. This is going to be an epic fight week here in Las Vegas for UFC 229. What are you most looking forward to? Knock out. I'm going out there, I'm going to sell for all. Make sure everybody gets what they're paying for. It. And I have the main events to come with. Talk to me about this matchup with Tony Ferguson. Obviously, like you just said, looking for the knockout. But what do you see from him as an opponent? Tony's a beast. I mean, 10 fight win streak, you can't deny it. But uh, he hasn't fought me yet. You know, I'm feeling 100% confident. So ready. I'm back on where I'm supposed to be at. Uh, my mental feels so good, so uh, it's not gonna work. No matter who is it for me. Do you feel like because you've been so active recently that that really is a big advantage going into the octagon this time around? Yeah, the biggest thing is the injuries. You know, I had a full year of training, no interruptions. I got to go in there, no break after a uh, fight from injuries. So a uh, full year of training. You know, I just also ready to kiss. So let's just start. Tell all these fans here why they should look forward to your fight with Tony Ferguson. Thank y'all, thank y'all. See y'all soon.
Allow yourself to grow. Allow yourself to make mistakes. Allow yourself to fail. Why? Because there's no success without failure. If you don't know how to battle back from attrition, look at this motherfucker right here. Five months, they told me one year. One fucking year. All the doctors said, you can't go back. They took my title. They took a couple of zeros off my paycheck. But motherfuckers, I'm still here fucking smiling.
most compete in front of my fans. Saturday night, you're in for a show. Twist me on that. I'm going to take his head off. Come on to me. I know that we've come to know you as Mystic Max, so you gave me a prediction when we sat down earlier this week. Could you tell everyone here what that is? Devastating KO. Too easily hit. Too flat footed. Too predictable. I'm going to compete now. We cannot wait for it. Connor, thank you so much for being here. What is your message to all of these fans that have waited these almost two years for you? It's good to be back. It's good to be bringing back. Let's go do it. A proper fight. A proper, proper fight. I'm going to come out the game fast. I don't give a fuck about anything. Any wrestling, any technique. 